Dear viewers, welcome you to all. Today we will talk about how to perform arterial blood gas analysis. The ABG is integral to the diagnosis of respiratory failure and primary hyperventilation. It also identifies the presence of metabolic acidosis and alkalosis. What are the other indications? ABG is done in suspected hypercapnic patient that is increased partial pressure of carbon dioxide proved by drowsiness, flapping tremor, bounding pulses. If there is clinical deterioration in patients with chronic type 2 respiratory impairment. In suspected severe hypoxemia proof by very low or unrecordable oxygen saturation or cyanosis, severe prolonged or worsening respiratory distress, hyperventilation, acute deterioration in consciousness, any severely unwell patient such as shock sepsis. If pulse oximetry is unreliable or there is suspicious result, as a part of recognized illness severity scoring system such as Glasgow criteria in pancreatitis. It also helps in guiding treatment and monitoring response in mechanically ventilated patients, patients receiving non-invasive assisted ventilation, patients with respiratory failure, patients with chronic hypercapnia receiving oxygen, critically ill patients undergoing surgery, candidates for long-term oxygen therapy now we will watch a patient where we are doing arterial blood gas analysis and we will collect blood in this patient from radial artery to perform first fill the radial pulse very cautiously After being uh, aseptic, then wear your gloves. Then wash the area with chlorhexidine or providan iodine solution, etc. then feel the pulse again and if you feel the pulse uh, very well then remove the middle finger and take the syringe and insert it at a 45 degree angle remove the syringe very slowly upwards with the negative pressure and when the blood comes then uh, the plunger will move automatically after collecting blood secure the punctured area then insert the syringe in the abg analyzer machine wait for few seconds then then sign of removal of this syringe will come remove the syringe and press the ok button wait for few seconds and you will get the result <laughs> 